Hey guys, thank you for watching and welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Breaking Burke. It is about houseplants and gardening here in the desert of Albuquerque, New Mexico. In today's video, I wanted to share with you one of my favorites for a shade area that does bloom. Uh, these are begonias. they are annuals in my area. Some places they do say they come back, but not for me. Uh, the pink and the red are called cocktail begonias. Uh, they have drink names. I don't know what they are exactly, but the other one uh, could potentially come back. I've seen some like that that claim they will, so who knows? We'll see. Uh, these are relatively inexpensive, and since they are labeled as annuals, uh, they should be. So all I did was take and uh, put the whole package into the hole that I dug to make sure that it fit. I have some fertilizer as always. If you can fertilize when planting, it would be best because you want to feed the roots. That's how the plant eats, aside from uh, photosynthesis, where it creates its own energy through uh, the sun. So you can see that one was fairly easy. All I did was take it out the pot and turn it over. Uh, None of these are rooted too heavily. You can see the root balls pretty much non-existent. It's just a packed ball of soil. And all this says is flowering begonias. So I can't even tell you what type it is, but it is pretty. You can see the spent blooms don't look so pretty, but the new ones do. You can keep deadheading and it'll continue to bloom. And then last I do have a little pink one just for some color variation here. These are a little more heavily rooted. You can see it's at least at the edge. So I have faith that they'll take. Uh, just remember, you always need to backfill properly. Press it down a little. You don't want to press down too much and suffocate the roots, just enough to be able to keep it in place. And then, uh, as always, whenever you plant something new, make sure you water it in and keep it moist for the first few days. I'm just gonna show you our little planting here. Hopefully it fills out a little more. Let's see if we can see some fish. There's quite a few, they actually had babies. I don't think we'll be able to see those. They kind of stay in the reeds and stuff. Thank you for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and have a great day. Bye.